What's up, MFGs? Mini, Eric MFG. We just saw yet another horror movie. Well, I wouldn't really call it horror, but it's on those lines. That would be Hugh Grant and Heretic. Religious horror. I say this is the best um, religious movie we've seen this year. Maybe, I don't remember how many we've seen. There's a bunch. Basically, what we got going on here, there's two sisters, Sister Paxton, Sister Barnes. They're they're on their mission to their Mormons. They're trying to get share beliefs. Yep, they're trying they're spreading their beliefs. They're trying to get converts to go to the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter day Saints. And they come across Mr. Reed, played by Hugh Grant. You know, I used to always hate Hugh Grant because he cheated on his wife Elizabeth Hurley. She's so hot. I don't know what what he was thinking. But you know, He's a really good actor, and he was he was fabulous in this. So they they get to this they get to his house, and he invites them in, but they can't go in, but unless there's a woman present, remember. But he says there's a wife. His wife is making blueberry pie, so they come in, but the actual blueberry pie is actually blueberry scented candle. There's no wife, and he he lies to them the whole time. He wants them to believe, and he's like he's like super smart on all the religions. And he makes them question their very beliefs. So the, the whole movie is about them, whether they choose to believe or disbelieve religion. And they're talking about all the religions and I have a test soon on all those. Yeah. Mini MFG said that she learned about this stuff this morning. She should have just skipped the first like half mm -hmm. of school to come to see this movie. But the, his actual house is like one giant maze that that they, they need out. that they need to that they need to venture through and he's got like little figures where he puts where he puts in, in the maze of where they are in his house it's kind of it's kind of cool actually would you say it was a cameo cameo who's the cameo no monopoly yeah there's he compared all the religions to the different versions of monopoly that came out with the the, the religion of mormonism to, to be like the rick ross Monopoly edition. Bob Ross. Whatever. Bob Ross. Of Monopoly edition is so funny. So, you know, unique take on on religious horror. Hugh Grant was awesome. I thought the girls were okay. I, I didn't really know who they were. Um, one looked emo. The other one looked yeah. weird. Scary. It was kind of a slow burn, up, uh, you know, for the entire movie. Payoff was, was you know, halfway decent. It kind of got a bit... Com convoluted at the end but I wouldn't really say I was on the edge of my seats but you know I would say it was, it was slightly slightly a thriller I thought it was like black phone just with religion yeah black phone was better black phone was better when this was, was okay if you know if I would have this is matinee day or not matinee day it's it's uh bargain Tuesday so we only had to pay like seven bucks so I probably wouldn't pay full price for this. It's more of like a streaming movie, but really good performances, uh, good, good aspects of the entire of the entire maze that these girls had to go through. Um, I'd see it again so I could ace that test. Yeah, she's gonna tell her teacher about it tomorrow. It's Heretic, I probably I, I slight recommendation for me. I probably go seven out of ten on this, just for Hugh Grant alone. I mean, he's kind of worth it. Eight point one eight. Yeah, so Heretic. Horror, not really horror. Thrilling, slow burn, seven out of 10, eight point something from an UFG. We're out of here. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share, bro.